Hey, uh, I bet you guys didn't know this, but I'm on 1,420 subs. <laughs> Bro, nah. that's pretty lit. Come on, boys. So I made a video uh, in January uh, called I'm Alex Says the M Word. And it got a fair number of views. And nobody's actually made this point, but I feel like someone could make this point. The fact that I was trying to expose I'm Alex in a way. I mean, I don't I don't think this is any, all over YouTube anywhere. That's why I got 17k views. I don't think anybody's uploaded it over YouTube. But uh, it wasn't... It, my intent wasn't for an exposer for I'm Alex. It's just a way to get views, wasn't it? Come on. Let's be honest. If you're going to upload a video like this, you're going to get views. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, that's what happened. So... Let's play the clip of I'm Alex saying the N-word and then we'll go over why he shouldn't be criticised. He's not been criticised for it. I'm going to go over why he really shouldn't and the meaning of the N-word. The N-word. The N-word is a funny moment. I don't say... <laughs> That's not what I'm showing you! So, as you could see in that video, I had a little meme in it. That was obviously in the original video. It was a very hilarious meme. If you like that meme, then you should like this video. Give it a fat like. Come on. Just give, it, give it a like. But, uh, obviously, my main point of this video is now. So, the title of the video was just gone. This is obviously not in the title of the video. But, let's just talk about the N-word. If I say the word nigger, then I am in trouble by YouTube. So, we're just going to say... N word. So let's also talk about why he is not a racist. He is not a racist because he was not directly calling a black person a N word or nigger or whatever you want to refer it to. Many people would probably see that as racist if you said. I saw a comment on a, a Tana Mong video. No, I don't watch it. I just watch another YouTuber criticizing it. And they said, it doesn't matter what context you say it in, it's still racist. So we got this word up here, nigger, and then we've got all the words at the bottom, such as the ones that I've put on the screen now. Them words are fine, them words are genuinely accepted in society, but if you say the n-word, then that's it, that's it, you're a racist, you're an idiot, you should be locked up, you should be euthanized, you should be killed, you should be tortured by the Middle Eastern people or Chinese, but if you say the word faggot, that's it, you're fine, you're fine, you know what? absolutely fine you can say that word that is stupid and i was doing a stream with my brother the other day and he literally said be careful when you're using that word so it was something like that obviously it was like come on don't say that you know i always say it to him in real life he says it to me we're fine by it we even call it each other sometimes very rarely though but the fact that he has to say that on youtube because youtube could potentially take down your video it is very stupid. It, the YouTube would probably say, yeah, you're harassing, mate. We can call each other idiots and it wouldn't be harassment. That is so stupid. And it just proves that the N-word has been blown completely out of proportion by people themselves. If you... When, when it is racist, I'm not saying it's not racist. It is racist if you directly call it to a black person. That's when it's racist, in a hateful way. If you're joking with that black person, then... It's racial humour, not racist. There is a difference between racial humour and being blatantly racist. I don't understand how many people don't know the difference between them two. It's very stupid. Like, if you're calling your black friend an N-word just to take the piss how society views it, then that's not racist. Racial humour. I don't get how people don't know the difference, and it's so stupid. It really does bug me, actually, how... Calling anyone the N-word, even if he's white, even if you're quoting someone. I remember a news report of someone quoting the N-word and he got he got done for saying, for quoting someone saying the N-word and saying how bad it was to use it. Like, that wasn't even his point. He was quoting someone saying it and how bad it is to use it. What? <laughs> if he's quoting it, he's not even giving it any context. He's just quoting it. And he got done for saying that. It's so stupid. You could say it's a video of me defending I'm Alex or defending any YouTuber who said, 
who said the N-word in the past, and it sort of is. Peter Pie said it. Who cares? He said it in a hateful way, yeah. He said it in a hateful way, yeah, but... He did not send it. If he hated towards... If he aimed it at a black person, intentionally trying to hate on them, then that is bad, then that is racist, and yeah, that's bad. And PewDiePie deserved backlash for that, but he didn't. He just said it in a game. <laughs> Why was everyone crying over it? And advertisers pulled out and everything. That it, it's so stupid, but... Uh, I know another YouTuber called Pyrocynical who said the N-word. And PewDiePie in the past, when he did a GTA 5 video, he said the N-word. Nobody cared. Because nobody cared back then. That was 2013 YouTube. I understand that it's, a diff it's different now. But what does that mean? Because YouTube's different. The N-word should be different even though it shouldn't have been changed at all. If you're quoting it, if you're saying it as a joke, it's fine. If you're aiming, if you're calling someone a faggot... With it in your mate way, like saying, oh, that's pretty gay, that. Should that be seen as blatant homophobia? But no, it's not seen as that. It's seen as you, obviously, just making a joke. It's so stupid, and I don't get why it's been blown out of proportion. If that's been blown out of proportion, why don't we just blow the word faggot, spick, out of proportion? I mean, we might as well. If the M-word is seen as this racial thing, then... I think the word faggot should be banned. Like, we should call it the F word. And then nobody should say that. Because that's where society's going now. That's where YouTube's going now. And because more and more people are getting offended from the slightest thing. From the, making themselves get offended. I mean, remember BuzzFeed. People made themselves get offended just for the sake of getting offended. It's stupid now. So, I've been ranting on enough now. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a like, subscribe share with your friends and families and your nan in hospital goodbye